Hi everybody, it's Miss Judy. I have a couple of quick cards today. One is using some paper from Hawthorne and a sketch from cardstv.blogspot.com. It is sketch number 27. And I followed her measurements on this one. Um, and we'll put it together. It goes together quick once you've got that uh, basic cutting done. And let me see. I have moved things around. So I'm trying to find my glue. <laughs> okay. First of all, today I lost a stamp set. Have you ever just had one of those days where... Okay, what's going on? I'm losing it. I'm losing it. Well, I've had one of those today. Got home from church and started to um, get together a couple of craft things, and then I couldn't find my stuff. But I found it. Okay, so we're going to put the first layer on the card base, which is an A2 card base. Then we're going to put the solid piece on top of the designer paper. And that one is four by, no, this is four by five and a fourth. This is three and three fourths by five. I actually added an extra layer. And this piece goes on next. It is 3.25 by 2.50 or three and a fourth by two and a half. Now she has hers kind of slanted. I think I'll do that too. I did two cards out of the same design and uh oh this is the next layer and I see what I've done. See I got going too fast. This border one by four is supposed to go on underneath here so we'll just Open that up and put it down. <laughs> sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. <laughs> this one does. Now, I used a stamp set from MayMayMadeIt.com. And this one is from her set uh, called uh, Country Pumpkin. It's still in the on her website, so you can go and order that. It's really cute. And I used... Um, no, I'm sorry. I used bushel and a peck on this one. And this is um, kind of a thanksgiving -y looking stamp set. And I used a bushel and a peck and a hug around the neck, which is right up here. And then I did the two bales of hay and a pumpkin on there. And my first one that I did, I actually decorated the bales of hay and the pumpkin, did some coloring in there. And then I put some little leaves, and the leaves are in the stamp set. So you can do whatever you want to. Right now, this one is going to be plain, and I'll just do something at some point. Then I also used another part from this one called that says Fall, and I'm going to put that up in the corner, like on Mary's design, and it's a one and one fourth cut circle. And then I have some stickies that I'm going to do up in the corner. I think I'll do the pumpkin colored ones just to decorate the, this little circle a little bit. Put a little accent on there. And I'll do th three. Put three on here. I'm using my pick, pick me up tool. Um, and I kind of like this most of the time because uh, <laughs> I'm kind of chasing this piece around. So I'll put that one up here in the top. Just three little. It's from, I think it's from Silhouette. And I ordered it from the Amazon. And it has a tool that picks up your sequins and rhinestones and stuff like that. And then it's got this other part that has a, a a glue type with it. I haven't even used that in, but I'll try it later. So 
once you have this put together, there's your card. You can go back into the card if you wish and do some uh, colors. This one I just put one. So that there I have my two cards using bushel and a peck from maymaymadeit.com and using cards TV blogspot.com kitten caboodle sketches and I actually ran off a lot of these and put them in a little folder and labeled them so that I have it available easily the next card we're going to do is is called a Judy design <laughs> I don't have my patent on anything but I did this little card because I had some scraps left over and I had cut out a web and didn't use that so I started looking around and I found in May May made it her country pumpkin set it says surf the web and it's got a little bug on there and so I just took that and daubed it around I'm using some spooktacular uh, paper and some little bats and some ribbon and trim so we'll just get this put down real quick and have a little Halloween card. Um, also, while I'm doing this, I want to chat a minute and tell you that I have a drawing. And every time you order something from my website, doesn't matter how much, just anything at all, you'll be entered into the drawing. And I will draw November the 1st. And the winner will get a set the let me scoot this over a little bit the August stamp of the month called from me to you it's really really cute it's got all kinds of expressions on there that are kind of what I call mod expressions and some contemporaries to happy birthdays and that kind of stuff so anyway I'll send this to you if you win the drawing, so get on my website, judyashmore.closetomyheart.com, create you an account, join me in some fun crafting. And this one, I see, I should have put that on first. I did not, so I will get out my tool. I'm going to have to name that tool my, my uh, repair tool. <laughs> and get that cut off so let's see here it is it's actually a finger crafting knife I guess you call it and I ordered this from the website put your finger in it's from friskers and then just go down and cut and I'll go ahead and cut this off too this little piece right here and then I'll go over to the other side get that off and cut down this side it's my fixer upper tool like in frozen I'm just a fixer upper and there so then I have my ribbon my web I have another web from some uh, things that I got little set from close to my heart that was left over I'll put a web up here and then I will finish it off with some bats and just kind of fill in yeah with some bats and then I have a simple card using some scraps using some leftover stuff and using a Miss Judy design. All right, there we go. And then I'll put a piece of white paper in here for you to sign your name and write any message that you might want to do. Um, this is really handy because it has a nice covering. <laughs> so I won't cut myself to pieces. I've already stabbed myself twice today. But anyway, here's this card. And here's my Hawthorne bushel and a peck. And this uh, uh, 
concludes my presentation today, my taping today. Uh, this is the stamp set that will be given away November 1st. So, thank you so much for watching. I love talking to all of you, and I love talking to myself. Ta-ta!